and welcome to the carnivore channel my name is matthew <laughs> if this is your first time to be here welcome i know it's about 10 o'clock i'm trying to be quiet darlene's already off to bed i haven't had enough protein okay um workouts went well we had a great time if you checked out my dollar tree video from earlier if you haven't dollar tree can be pretty crazy they've got mackerel at a good price anyway so being on the carnivore diet, you should eat like, um, just like in the, well, I mean, just eat when you're hungry, right? But I try to get in so many grams of fat. What am I talking about fat? I mean, so many grams of protein um, per day. So far, I only had like, what was it? I only had about 70 grams of protein. So... We're gonna go ahead and jump on in here. It's pretty neat because as you're laying in bed, as I said before, when you're on the carnivore diet, you don't have to have so much fiber. You just don't, um, which you, you don't have to have actually any fiber. I mean, that's the case. Um, yeah, you're just regular, you feel great. I think today's day 96. I think I'm on day 96, okay? And uh, yeah, so I need to get my appearance of protein in. I'm gonna pick up another 100 at least. I might pick up another 54 with a can of tuna that I'm going to make after I make my steaks. Because when I make my steaks, there's going to be the butter and then there's going to be uh, the flavor of the steaks that's gonna be left in there. So after that, I think I'm gonna make a really spicy. Uh, if you checked out the recipe, I hope you do. I think I, I think I got called that tuna bang bang, okay? Ooh, that stuff is good. Now, if you are carnivore, if you think about going carnivore, if you think somebody might benefit from going on a carnivore diet, please, if you would, please put the word maybe in the comments. Putting the word maybe in the comments, what it does is helps with the algorithm, and there's a very good possibility that they'll find out about the carnivore diet because of you. So, yeah. All right, let's come on, let's come on to the kitchen. I got the butter already heating up, which is totally cool. Okay, before we can go in there, let me go ahead and grab the tripod. All right. Very good. So we got the porcelain. The porcelain right here that's heating up. That's what I'm talking about. I'm going to go ahead and get the tripod up and ready. Cool. Let's see here. Okay. The only other thing that we're gonna do, I'm gonna put the phone down for one second. The only thing that else we're gonna do is we're gonna put a little bit of paprika on that bad boy. So we're gonna go ahead. What we're gonna be making tonight, tonight's gonna be, if I haven't already said so, or what it's gonna be, it's gonna be the blackened steak. So I'm gonna go ahead and lower that a little bit. There you go. Right. Get some black and steaks going on here. So black and steaks, what we're gonna do is you hear that? No, that's not that like music right there. Yes, sir. These steaks right here, they are English steaks. And they're about 50 grams of protein a piece. So there you go. These right here cost about $2.50 to $3 combined. I did use a Sam Portal, $12 for like $17, right in there. That's a toy steak for $17. Okay, this is going to be two coming in set. Yeah. Right. Now we got the pepper, boy. Yes, sir. I like my pepper, and I like them black. Okay. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and flip them. I'm not gonna put too much more on there because I am putting paprika. Which I should have already put it on the other side. The paprika is gonna add a specific flavor. Actually, we love it. Okay. And what I'm gonna do, we're gonna put it on here again. If you've never tried paprika on your steak, I highly suggest you do that. The paprika puts a certain fla a flavoring on there, which is just absolutely magnificent. Also, paprika is known for 
taking out information. Okay, there we go. All right. There we go, the paprika going on there like a bad boy. What? Yes, sir. Gotta try that paprika on your steaks. Unless you're so set in how you usually do your steaks, definitely be open minded on this one. I'm tempted to put some ground turmeric and pepper in there, but I'm just not going to do it. No, sir. You know what I'm going to do, though? I'm going to do something else. All right. First and foremost, I'm going to go ahead and put the timer on. I'm not going to time this stuff. I have no gut feeling on it. I get a good feeling on flavorings, and my gut says, Ooh, put a lard in that bad boy. That's what I'm talking about. Lard is one of the healthiest things we can eat. I know. You've been told otherwise. We've been told wrong with so many things. It's unbelievable. One of the things that throws me off is the fiber. You know, we don't need fiber. I'm on day 96, and I feel absolutely phenomenal. So, you don't need fiber. I'm very regular. After two weeks, I found out that was all a joke. I'm going to turn on another lady real quick so you can see any better lady. Maybe that adjusted a little bit. Maybe you can see better. But this is the paprika I'm using. Dude, just some great value paprika. With the pink Himalayan stuff. To show you specifically on the pink Himalayan, I got this from here. Yeah, that's right. Um... Really cute bottle. I think I'll always keep that bottle. Ooh, that sounds like magic to me. That snake over there, boy. Oh my word. Let me go ahead and look it down. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. Right now we got about 35 seconds before we're going to be flipping again. The smell on there. Oh, that sounds so good. Oh, man. So, but yeah, when you're on the carnivore diet, you eat when you want to, eat when you're hungry. Again, if you're working out, I'm working out a lot. You want so many grams of protein, you just fall through. You've got a lot of healing to do. I have a lot of healing to do. I think we all do. And... That is a pretty looking steak, boy. Look at that. Oh, my word. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, look at these spices, man. Come on, man. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Those are looking sexy, boy. Oh. All right. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to add a little more butter and I'm gonna have to turn them down. So, we got time to do this one on there and eat it. I'm gonna do it. Hopefully, the timer is not bothering Darlene. And she is sleeping in the other room. She might kill me. Alright, now, what I'm gonna be doing after this is I'm gonna be adding that thing of tuna to what's left. And I will show you. I think I'm going to go ahead and show you all that. If you didn't check it out earlier, I call this tuna bang bang. I need it is that bang over here. So now it's going to have a little bit of flavor of the steak. It's going to have, this is going to give us 50 more grams of protein. Unbelievable. So this is, this is about, well, yeah, this is going to be about as much protein as one of the Because one of these steaks, here's the tuna. We always want to get our tuna in water. Showing that to you because it's about to go in there. It's about to get bad. What we're going to put in our tuna bang bang is we're going to put in some crushed bell pepper. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And we're going to be putting, well, we're going to do a crush. We can throw some pepper in there. Sure, we can. Um, also, we got to have our cayenne, boy. Got to have that cayenne. Also, we might put our normal butter in. Pretty much can be it. 
if we want to, we can throw some garlic powder. There's no, there's no shame in garlic powder. Definitely, it's an enjoyable thing. You know, we can even throw some minced onions in. Why don't we do that? We can do that. For sure. Ooh, we could use some ground white pepper. That'd make it spicy. Well, let's do that. Guys, our steaks, we are done. We're gonna go ahead and take those out. All right, check these out. Absolutely gorgeous steaks. We want the seasonings, but we really don't want the grease. So, have some these. Now, I want you to know something. You might be thinking, hey, what about those seasonings? But you were this next, whew, that is 100 grams of, of protein. This one right here, we're gonna call it three dollars. The next one's two dollars. 154 grams of protein, approximately, is what we're about to have. Here we go. Matter of fact, I'm gonna go ahead and put the steaks over here so you can see the combination of what we're doing for a combination. So what's happening now? This is what's happening now. Here we go. Hey. You hear this music? Oh my goodness. Yeah. So what's happening about the new display right here? Oh my goodness. Now, when you're looking at tuna, tuna is pretty dry, okay? You gotta be careful when you can't eat big bites of it. You know, when you, you just can't. It's just, it's very dry, it's just stuck in your throat. This is one of the ways I eat it. I also eat a plain, but you know, don't get me wrong. But this right here, oh man. And I think about the flavor we have in there. Okay. Yes, we just put a bunch more butter in. That butter is melting. You know, more better butter. You know, we're just going to do it. We're going to have fun with it. Okay. We're going to go ahead and throw some paprika in there right now. That's right. I'm gonna throw some paprika. Paprika is good for keeping down inflammation. Nothing that we're putting in here is gonna cause any inflammation. Carnivore diet is all about no inflammation. So we did our paprika. The cayenne is gonna be what's gonna send this uh, off. Absolutely love my cayenne. Have a bunch of cayenne. Can't get enough cayenne now, guys. Can't get enough. All right, these peppers. I have a huge container of these. I didn't know I was going to be enjoying them this much. Obviously, I'm going to be enjoying them. So, oh, yes, sir. I think that's more than enough. Okay. Now I'm going to do a little bit of garlic powder. Got the garlic powder going in. I feel like this should be this tuna bang bang or call it mash or something. We're going to put some, get some onion flavor in there. Get some minced onion. And, you know, I got to have my pepper gotta have it. I, uh, if I'm already putting pepper in there, should I put the white pepper in? I don't know. This is going to be three little white peppers. Oh, that's a pretty, there you go. It's got its own flavor to it. None of it's going to hurt. You can definitely smell the white pepper. Oh, I'm just making sneeze, actually. Okay. Get the rest of the tuna out of there. I'm going to get all that protein. Okay. So, right now, I'm just mixing it up and having some fun. Ooh, hey. I'm telling you, man, if you haven't tried something like this, if you think that eating carnivore is expensive, this is $5, guys. $5, two steaks. Go to Sam's Club. You can find those steaks. Go anywhere to be able to get some tuna at a really good price. Yes, sir. Just be sure to get in water. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and thin this out. Right now the burner is on low, just gonna give you a heads up. Now, you see that? It's just absolutely, just just full, just bouncing full of flavor right now. Just bouncing. What we're doing is we're gonna just give them a little bit of time for those red peppers to be able to soak in the juice to give it the flavor to soften up. Yes, sir. Uh, When I made this the other night, I um, 
is just a new creation. And man, it was it had a bang to it, boy. As you can tell, I mean, it's going to with the cayenne and the crushed pepper in there. All that pepper I put in, you got the garlic, uh, the pepper. Mm, the butter makes it so good. Let me go ahead and take a bite. That is insane. If you like something hot, if you will, you're trying to, oh my word, you're not giving up anything. Nope. Oh, the cardboard that gives you the best of everybody. Oh my word. Oh my goodness. That is so bad. Whoo. <clears throat> it's late. I'm better in the video. Y'all have a beautiful night. Thank you for checking it out. I mean, you might absolutely love my steaks. And you know I'm going to love this. And you're on the carnivore diet. Guys, be creative. <clears throat> Y'all have a beautiful night. Get some sleep. I'll be going to sleep here in a little bit after I do a little more from the working out. Bye.